I know people is that so we're going from one week last is the 27th of the 9th and as you can see I'm uh, just about to put my weight in again so the last time was 16 stone 4 pound or 228 pound um, I will show you what I weigh now so if we go over to here and click this there's my new weight so I've managed to lose another 4 pound uh, pretty much the same as last time which kind of makes sense really um, uh, like I said overall my um, my total I think uh, basically to get to four four five nine I think I'd have to put I think I'd have to do something like 800 to get to that or no even more so the end of today I'd have to be around a thousand calories um, 1200 maybe now to get my average roughly even more than that 1400 so we would have to be around 350 just to yeah so that's how much I'm allowed to well if I wanted to level off that's how much I can have today uh, to get to 459 so obviously <coughs> Now you well, forgive me, I've got a bit of a sore throat today. So basically, I'm not going to get to that, obviously. Um, what I'm going to do is probably stick to around 300 today. So by the end of today, I would have around the 300 mark, which gives me a minus 4, 554. Obviously, because of this week, you don't really notice that this is going to be a continuing on from the following from the following so you know I don't think the last week really counts as much towards your weight loss as I would like it to but you know it's a overall it's a great reduction in um, in my average over the five weeks um, now I don't know it maybe the next five weeks if I could stay on around this or under it I may lose another four pound, but I know it's getting very, very difficult now. And um, what I will do now is what I always do. So I will start getting this one ready. So uh, the first thing I do, obviously, is the I'll put the date in there, the twenty seventh of the night. Oh, well, I put it in there, didn't I? And then I'll slash. Uh, I have done this for over five weeks, so bear with me, people. I may get a bit confused, like I always do. Uh, scroll down. That one does that one. Then I'll do uh, zero four slash ten slash twenty seventeen. So then I'll click away. I'll click back on it. I'll click to the ad. I'll pull it all the way down like this. As you can see, um, then I'll do the temp slash ten. Uh, yeah, I was getting a bit confused there. I don't know if I said I would. No, uh, that's wrong, Bobby, because it's not the temp. Because that's the temp. If you want to go to the eleven, then I'm going to scroll this down. Yeah, like I said, doing it this way has helped me so much. It's unbelievable on how much I've uh, been able to lose. Uh, that brings my grand total up now to £62 since February. Um, which I think is... A, I, I just can't believe it. <coughs> um, 34, 10, 3, 17, um then all this is done so I've got all my weight sorry I've got all my dates sorry right now so what the next thing I'm going to do now is I'm going to go up to this week I'm going to highlight all these because I've already got all this set out um, if you if you want to learn how to do the colouring and all that type of thing uh, watch my other watch my beginning videos because I do go through on how to do all this um, even though it isn't the same kind of is a different for, uh, table and all that but if you watch the videos you will see me see the progression I make so uh, format this I'll, then I'll highlight this one then I'll just uh, then I'll just uh, format it again 
No, I didn't format. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, damn. Messed that way up, I? I told you I messed up. So now you just want to... I just click on that one. Uh, format this one. I thought I did format it. So now we've just gone to this one. We've just formatted that. Now you can just format this one and just go through all of them the same. <coughs> well, this store approach to my edit. Past few months, I've had sore throat after sore throat after sore throat doing my edit. Format. 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 Then. Format. So now, most of them should be pre done for me. So now. Uh, it's quite straightforward. Put 600 in there, for example. That's uh, 600 down there. Um, I'll just go along here and change all these to black. Um, so now, obviously, I want to do my black ones now. Um, if we just double check the sum up here, so I76. I76. What the hell? I seven six gotta do. That's I seven I seven six. I think there's a problem here, people. That shouldn't be high seven six. Oh no, I was clicking on the wrong one. Duh. I was clicking on that one. Wasn't I? Oh my god, I'm a knob sometimes. I really am. Right, you want to click on the black one. So as you can see, the black one said I eight three. So I eight three, and then you just take away the previous blue one. Um, so that would be in this case I seven three. So on this one, I'm going to put equals uh, equals that one. Take that one. Like right, that, and then it gives me my total. Obviously, if I zero that one away, then obviously I get that number in the black one. So I know now I've got 1,404 calories to go this week. Um, obviously, it's going to be difficult. Um, I'm not going to say it's going to be easy because it's not. It's going to be very difficult. Um, I'm at that point now where <coughs> my body's getting into a better shape, so I'm able to I'm able to um, do more exercise. But you know, the amount of exercise you've got to do is just unbelievable compared to like you know how 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 much you burn off kind of thing. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm at that stage now. Um, I'm, I'm starting to try and uh, up my cardio exercises more because I can. Um, you know, I'm listening to my body. It's not like I'm. It's not like I'm just going for it and hurting myself. I'm actually listening to my body, and my body's quite happy for me to uh, keep doing that type of thing. Um, obviously, minus the flu, which is a night. Well, the sore throat, not flu. Yeah, um, the sore throat is a pain, right pain in my backside. Um, the last few months I've had nothing but flu or sore throat. Or, but yeah, <coughs> as you can see, that's how I that's how I do it all. Um, if I just go along all these, well, generally I don't put nothing in them. Um, these are just all done. Oh, sorry, people, that's my uh, water meter telling me to drink water. Yeah, um, like I said, <coughs> it is um, it is mad on how much I've lost. Um, if I go up, and, like you know, go all the way, well, I could show you an actual chart that I've got my total weight loss. So, as you can see, I started on the first of February. I don't know if you see that because it's a bit small. Um, I, I suppose I can zoom in a bit. 
Yeah, there we go. So as you can see, I've zoomed right in now. So you can see it when I started, I was two two eight six or around twenty stone something, and I'm bouncing right get right back down to two two four. As you can see, the graph shows a quite a good continuous weight loss each month. I've done it, um, and here is the actual figure. So I started off on two eight six. Uh, my BMI was thirty point eight. Which is ob. The, this is the downside. Is is um, I'm still classed as ob, so I got to get down to two 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 hundred and twenty pound to get out of that area, which is a bit of a pain. But you know, lo a loss to date is sixty two pound, which is a hell of a good weight to lose. Um, I will go back over to my uh, diet program now. Um, as you can see, I've just sorted all that out, so so I'm done now for the uh, next five weeks. And uh, yeah, I've, uh, my nurse is sore throat. I've had one hell of an energy boost, and <clears throat> if if you if you know weight loss is much to do psychology with your with your well being and your and psychology and thinking than it is about just giving up food you like. Um, I haven't given up food I like. I'm still eating the food I like, just on a smaller scale with more control. So never take a large bit of, say, chocolate or a pack of peanuts in the living room with you. That that that's deadly, people. That is. You know, you need to split everything up into small little sandwich packs. You can buy the bags, uh, little sandwich bags. And all you do is all the nice food you like, you just split it up and weigh it up. And then you know that last, for example, cashew, nut, cashew nuts I love. Um, I've split them up into 30 gram bags. So I know each bag is 183 calories. Um, it really is a lot of hard work knowing your numbers, knowing the calorie numbers, and then obviously working it out. But you you put the effort in, and it take you a good twenty five weeks, maybe thirty weeks to start to really notice. But you keep at it, you will. And and the bigger you are, if you're over twenty stone, I'll tell you, you will absolutely the weight of fly off. Um, but you've got to put that effort in. You've got to. You've got to do that. And you know, I'm not saying if you're starting brand new, start off very slow. So you know, get, let the numbers control what you can. Eat. Don't don't go by like, oh well, I've got to stick to 2,000 calories. Or no, what you do is you eat your food, and then and then like I've shown people before. You just do a simple little table like this, <coughs> and then you let you eat what you you know you've got to control how much you're eating. But that doesn't mean that you can't eat what you like. So you know, just just make a list, and then towards say around four or five o'clock. You know exactly how much you bet, and 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 obviously walk in and stuff like that. You can put on your activities, and then I would recommend buying an indoor uh, pedal bike. Um, there are the little ones that that can be put into the corner. They're not a full size exercise bike. They're just a little simple little pedal bikes you can pick up for around thirty pound. And all you've got to do is just start on that. And then just start off pedaling, checking the calories, and then and then adjusting your calories like that. If you're brand new, I would go for a offset amount of around six to seven hundred calories. So at the end of each day, you want this offset number down here to be say in around seven hundred calories. Uh, you don't want it to be any higher than that, really. Uh, but 700, when when you take into consideration your sleep, uh, that's the other thing you've got to take into consideration. Don't forget your sleep. There's plenty of apps out there that will uh, tell you how much your how much calories you're burning off when you sleep. 
Um, like I said, I've got to I've got to redo this myself. I think I could turn on my own phone now, my old phone actually, and that should tell me roughly on how much. No, I can't. It's dead. I haven't used it in a while, so it's gone dead. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna have to reclassify that myself because obviously now I've lost another four pounds, so I'm lower again. I will get on to sorting that out, so I reckon it might just go down to around 500, around the 590 something mark. But yeah, it, the more like like when I was really heavy, when I was 20 odd stone, that was like 724 or something like that. So you know, you 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 you're when you when you wake up it from from the when you wake up in the mornings, you're already on a deficit. You're already minus. So as long as you eat something, like with me, I always have my cereal. Breakfast, go for a high fiber cereal because that helps you fill up. It fills you up longer. Uh, so that's the best thing to do with that. But yeah, you can eat. You, you, you can eat on a massive scale what you like, but you can still eat it and lose weight. Um, you don't have to cut out the diet completely. Um, you know, for me, it's only been the last two months. So the last two months, which, well, this this month and that month. That month, not so much, but this month I've been, been doing a lot more cardio exercise, which means uh, getting my heart rate right up. Uh, I, I've got a Fitbit now, so I know my heart rate, I know what my cardio has to be, and I've got to try and work up to my peak. Um, at the moment, I haven't really hit my peak that much uh, because it's very difficult. But yeah, <clears throat> if I want to continue losing the weight, I've got to I've got to up my game again, uh, which means even lower calories. Um, like I said, the week coming up now, uh, that's going to be solid. Um, if we were to do a uh, simple simple workout so essentially I got one four zero one uh, if I divide that by seven days uh, this to be my total so 200 total each day to stay on the same level as I was before so that's a hell of a drop from what I was yeah you know, say if I allow myself 400 on here I'd have to add that here. Um, it is getting very difficult now, um, as I've said before. Uh, but a weight loss, two two four, um, four pound weight loss. I'll take that. Um, Sixteen stone. I up. I cannot believe how much I've lost, and you know how well I'm going. So, yeah. Um, I would advise you people to do the same type of thing. Maybe use a different program, or maybe just write it out on paper. If, if, you know, it, it works the same. You don't have to use uh, Microsoft Excel. This principle quite it could quite easily be done on paper, uh, on a little pad. So every day you could just write down what you're eating, get the calories in there. Then at the end of the day, just write, just just add it all up and and. But like I said, because I'm, I'm one that has my tea quite early, around 4 o'clock. So, you know, I've got that quite a few hours to, to, to burn off the excess calories that I've had. Um, but obviously, now that I'm getting lower, I'm going to have to start watching my calorie, calorie amount. Uh, so, you know, my aim now is to try and stay below 2,000 calories per day. Uh, so I am kind of moving over to that way now, but that's only because I've lost so much already. Um, as you can see, it's been my second five weeks now that I've only lost four pounds. So I'm I'm at that point now where my body's like, no, we don't like this austerity. We want food, and maybe that's why I'm getting so many so many colds. <laughs> They're struggling to cope. <laughs> But yeah, um, uh, it's amazing what I've lost. And like I said, this can be you. If you started the beginning of October, by summertime next year, you would be in the position that I'm in now. Um, you know, it may sound mad, but doing it this way and letting the numbers help you 
and you can focus on it every day and make sure you're filling that out every day you will lose a lot of weight and and it takes time and it's taken me a long time now I was hoping that I could get down to 200 pounds by Christmas but I don't think that I don't think that's going to be realistic now but you never know you never know people so what I'll do now is I will leave it there and say thanks for watching um, until the 31st of the 10th which the way this year is going will be very fast <laughs> uh, Tana people and good luck with your weight loss uh, you'll get there 